Ha, this video is brought to you by Squarespace. I have been on YouTube for almost a full decade. And in that time, there has been some scary moments. There have been people that have actively tried to find my address, that have made videos about trying to find my address. I'm not kidding. It terrified me. I got home security on every door and every window of my house just so that I could sleep peacefully at night. But as of yet, that I know of, no one has actually found where I live. Thankfully, the day I feared most has arrived. Somebody found where I live. How they did it, I don't know. But it's what they chose to do with it that I found most intriguing. A company found my home address and sent me a big PR box package expecting me to make a video about their product. I have a PO box you could have sent this to, which would have been far less creepy. And to send me something with the audacity of expecting me to make a video about it is insane. But what makes matters worse is it couldn't have been a worse product. <laughs> Back you gone. Really? But I wasn't the only one that received this package. Hello? Hey, how you going? What, what's up? Just a random question. Do you remember when you were sent a whole box of Bakugan? Yeah, yeah, I remember that. What did you do with it? I gave it to some kids, some of my cousins. Because you didn't ask for it, right? No. Did it get sent to your home address? Yeah. How did they find your home address? I think it's with a, a company that does PR stuff, like that I've signed up for for a list. Oh, I don't believe I ever signed up to that. Oh, did you get one too? Yes. Oh. Well, at least yours makes more sense. Oh, were you trying to figure out how you got it? Yes! They've sent me stuff before and I looked at it. I think they just take creators' names down for like, for, for a list and then they just randomly send stuff out. Oh, okay. That's all I yeah, wanted I, to know. When they like, yeah, take it too far and like, you know, I took a picture of the box and all this stuff and then... Okay, thank you. Yeah. I, I appreciate it. Why, did you think you had to make a Bakugan video now? No, I am making one, but it's probably not gonna go how they want. Oh! Uh, because the game's terrible. I don't know yet, but I didn't agree to it and I didn't give them my address. So that's the video I'm making. Oh, you're, it's like they randomly sent me <laughs> this, uh, this box of stuff. You just like dropped your Starbucks? What was that? Oh no, there was a, there was a like a really long like centipede looking thing downstairs and I threw a box out. Okay, bye John, sub to spawn wave. <laughs> I have a random question. Okay. Do you remember being sent a package to your home address that you didn't ask for? Yes. Do you remember what was in that package? Yes. Um, um, what's it called? Fucking game, it came on on Switch. It's Toys the Lives or Bakugan. Yeah, you go, buddy. <laughs> How did they get your address? Do you know? No, because it's my home address. Would you agree with me that A, probably shouldn't send something to a creator unless they've agreed to do something with it and be maybe ask for their address before you somehow find it. Yes, completely agree. Well, Spawn would have got it too. Yeah, I know. We just talked to him. He wouldn't stop farting. He also killed a centipede with a box. Wow, I was having a busy day over there. All right, that's all. Thank you. There you go. This is not a sponsored video, not by Bakugan anyway, but I'm going to do the video that they probably didn't want me to do. <clears throat> Bakugan is an expansive open world action role-playing game based on the globally popular anime TV series. So I don't know how much I'm going to enjoy this, but I'm going to try. I guess we should start by opening the actual game. It actually smells really good. Like, <laughs> it smells like coffee and a cinnamon danish. I don't know why. So the deluxe edition of the game in itself comes with a ball, a ball, a ball, a ball, a couple of cards and some tokens and then the game. Okay, well that downloads. We'll go ahead and open this, uh, the, uh, this uh, thing. If you want this, message me below and I'll message you asking for your home address. And once you have given me permission to send a package to your house, where you feel safe, I will send this to you because I really don't need it. Can't promise it's gonna get- What the heck? It caught me! It really did. Focus on the blood! Well, I probably shouldn't- <laughs> I didn't realize this was Nintendo Labo. Oh, it also comes with a, uh, a pimple. <laughs> Dr. Pimple Popper MD here. a stubborn pimple. Do I really need the instructions for six bits of plastic and some cardboard? 
Oh. I was trying to like click it in somehow, assuming that it actually made something. I think you just have to carefully line the border up around the cardboard. All right, it's... <laughs> It, it is exactly what it looks like, I guess. But for some reason, I just, I don't know. I thought it would be bigger and cooler. Whatever. So the game is done installing and we can start playing. I didn't really plan anything for that. I don't know how I'm supposed to see the game. It's a blue eyes, white dragon. Oh, that was actually pretty cool. He like snapped to life. He's kind of cute. It's like a fat little dragon thing. I kind of like it. No, 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 I hate it. I actually, I hate it. Just so happens to be very cute. This guy's got a lot of junk in his trunk. Look at this guy. This guy's like, oh, booty. They sent like, like, the, like everything. This is like some kid's dream and my nightmare. Oh yeah, I know. Here you are watching an awesome video and then suddenly pff, you got a sponsor. Bill who sucks to be you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Squarespace is the easy to use all-in-one platform to build a beautiful website or run your business or to just show off what you're all about. Whether that's doing what I do, I use Squarespace as a landing page so when people come to my website they can find all my social medias and videos. Or pff, you could just make a website that's yourself on a horse with a pink helmet. Com. And I don't know anything about making websites, so when I was building my Squarespace site, I was so impressed with how easy it was to throw things together. I just selected one of the many sleek templates they have, and I just went to work customizing it. There are endless possibilities. Just make it already. Head to squarespace.com for a free trial, and when you're ready to launch, visit squarespace.com forward slash beat-em-ups to get 10% off a domain or website. Imagine living in 2021 and not having your own website. I mean... <laughs> All right, back to the video. This is like some kid's dream and my nightmare. Maybe I shouldn't open everything, right? If I'm giving it away... Well, I kind of want to see what's in... Oh my god. Oh, it's... It's empty. I thought it was gonna have like all of these balls in it. Let's go ahead and, and open it. I want somewhere to store my balls. What's happening over here? Oh, it kind of looks like Pokemon. Oh, hold up a minute. I just want to battle. I just want to do one. I just want to do one battle. Is that this guy? That don't look like that at all. Okay, I'm gonna brawl online. We have an opponent. I have a card. Maybe if I touch the card. No. Ooh. There's obviously some kind of magnet in here. So put him on there and then go. Magnet, magnetize. <laughs> I don't get it. Oh, it does come with a guy. Oh, oh I think I have two of him now. But whatever. You look, look at all that. You put all your balls in here, I guess. You put that ball. Close, you little gremlin. I bet it could be super cool. You're like, you got like a little briefcase of balls. You like roll up in a skull. All the kids are playing their buckle gun and you're like... Ready to do it. You lost the match. That's no surprise. My only options are to do story mode and brawl online. The brawl online had nothing to do with any of this, I don't think. It didn't tell me. So I guess I have to do the story mode. Not really like prepared to do. I'm sat here. I'm not recording my gameplay. I could turn my computer on and, and face that. I'm gonna have to look over here. Is that, is that okay with all of you? We don't really have an option. Okay. It's kind of weird, isn't it? I just want to battle. Find and collect four soccer balls? No! What is this game? Let me battle the stupid little ball monsters. Where are the balls? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I, I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> How boring. All right, fine. Four soccer balls. Give them back to Dylan. And then surely we'll get to do something with all of this, right? Surely something to do with this is going to come into play. Dylan, here's your balls. Yes. 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 The video is saved. The bigger the glow, the more energy. During the uh, hexagon grid, called the hide matrix. This is the hide matrix. Run over to the, to the quarter to, to collect it. Okay, I've got it and I, th I threw it. Press the A button now to attack. Fireball! We did a fireball. What's the, what is this? What is, yeah, 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 whatever. Health, hit points, you know, we get it. So how do I, how do I like? <laughs> we'll do a cycling warmth. We'll run over and pick that up. Then we'll look at our board. 
We'll touch this guy, and then we'll look back. Now we'll do that that thing. And then we wonder what this does. And then we'll grab more energy. Grab more energy. Grab more energy. We'll run over and we'll grab more energy. And we'll come over here. We'll grab more energy. We'll grab over here. We'll run more energy. And we'll run over here. We'll grab more energy. And now we have enough. Not 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 enough. Now we have enough. Impact laser. Huge move. Massive damage. Dead. What am I missing? Maybe in the main story, you don't use all of this. Maybe it's only when you're battling other players. I mean, that would make sense because like I got a whole board here, right? But my only two options are story mode and brawl online. Like there's no offline mode. Can you not play two players locally? You, you need to have, I guess, two games and two switches. And then the story mode doesn't use any of this. I'm so confused. Let's try the online and see if I can use all of this somehow. It's finding me an opponent right away. So hopefully we can just figure this out. I guess Bakugan Online isn't exactly popping. I hope we actually get someone. Oh no. Never mind, we found someone. It only took a good 10 minutes. We found the one other person online. All right, cool, great. All right, cool. Wait, so you still just race to get the hexagons before the other players? So why don't I use all of this? How are you so much faster than me? Oh, I am saving up for my huge move. Take my impact laser. You think your crappy blue boy is any match for my big red boy? Oh, critical hit. I got a heal. I got a heal. I'm healing. You can do this, big boy. Don't lose faith. No. Oh. Oh, I resisted. This is a nail biter. The only way I can win is if I get enough to do the big move. I need one more. I need one more. I need one more. Do it. Do it. Do it. Yeah. <laughs> no, they're down to 50. Oh, it's all over. I got beat by the one other person online. This is very boring. Can I just throw that out there? I'm trying to get into it for the video's sake, but I can see this getting very repetitive. Well, I've been playing for an hour and a half. I've done the story mode. I've done an online battle. I don't know where all this fits into it. Do they even go together? I'm actually, now I'm thinking about it. Nothing actually says you can use these toys with a Switch, right? In fact, these don't even have Switch branding on them. I can't find anyone that's actually used the toys with the game. I don't, I don't, I'm so confused. Are these actually in any way related? It comes with one of the toys. Bakugan for Switch has the most boring battles. That's a Kotaku article that popped up while I was trying to figure out if you actually use these toys in the game. There's a quest around town. Tw Am I dumb? Can you not actually use any of this with the game? This is just a separate card game board thing. Really? All these toys and a Switch game that came with one of the toys. I assumed that it was Toys to Life. In fact, I think it was even Spawn Wave or, or RGT that said Toys to Life. It's toys to Life or Bakugan. Yeah, you go, buddy. So this Kotaku article, I actually ended up clicking on it. it, says the actual game is nearly as disappointing as the announcement turned out to be. Not only does it have the most tedious Bakugan battles ever, which I already could tell by battling one time that that was going to be very repetitive and very boring. We don't even get to see the transforming monsters transform. This is a simplified version of the physical game. You create a simple avatar who collects and battles Bakugan with the aim to become the very best like no one ever was. I see what you did there, Kotaku. Haha. -ha. Nobody is like mentioning or asking or talking about the fact that these toys don't get used in the game at all. They're completely irrelevant. The toy-based game is still the toy-based game and the Switch game is just a completely separate boring Switch game. They didn't merge the ideas together, but they packaged and sold them together. I'm assuming to confirm confuse the audience and confuse poor parents and grandmas into buying little Jimmy like 10 different sets of things that they think they're gonna get to play on their Switch but they can't actually use at all! And what they get is this very boring and watered down version of a Bakugan Pokemon crap game that's barely playable in itself and there's no one left online playing it probably because of how boring it actually is! I was actually willing to give it a chance but I can't believe that. Yeah. So I've been sat here for an hour and a half making this video. I was trying to figure out how to get the toys to work in the game somehow. You know how you said yourself toys to life? Oh yeah, no, it's not actually toys to life. <laughs> was I the only one that didn't realize this? Oh, uh, I kind of realized it. The game sucks, by the way. Oh, I know, yeah, I never played it. All right, well, um, cool. I assumed RGT wouldn't have known if Spawnwave also knew. 
Yo, what's up, boy? I have spent the last hour and a half making this video. I have finally realized the toys has nothing to do with the Switch game. Yeah, those are just extra things. How did I not know this? Oh, you thought it was like Toys to Life. Yeah! Yeah, no, no, that's just, that's just stuff you'd walk into Walmart and find on the shelves. All right, cool, thank you. You're welcome. So all of this that I didn't want in the first place, might I add, that was sent to me without me asking or knowing or even understanding how it arrived at my front door is useless and pointless to me because I'm not interested in playing Bakugan. I might maybe be interested in playing if it somehow worked with the Switch game, which is what I do here. I feel like an idiot. I don't know why I assumed all of this worked together. I mean, why wouldn't it? But it seems like I'm the only person on the internet that actually thought that this was somehow gonna work together. Removing! All of it and leaving this, you have, as I already described, a very, very bad game. Don't buy this. Maybe buy the toys if you have an interest in playing with the toys. The toys are probably more fun than the game. That's the video. I apologize. Bye. If you're a PR company that wants to send me something for me to check out on the channel, email me first and I would love to work with you. It'd be really cool. Don't find my address and send something to me without me knowing. And if you do, at least send something good.